Accused did not hold back when it made its Fox premiere, becoming a successful show that catered to the tastes of a network TV audience. The performers on the programme put in a lot of hard work, and throughout the first season, it was every bit as dramatic and brutal as the British crime thriller it was based on. With an episode that is sure to have fans debating various facets of the narrative, Accused Season 2 dives headfirst back into the fray which is precisely the idea. Lorraine's story, the first episode of Season 2, centres on a purported psychic medium who faces accusations of fraud when her most recent vision fails to produce desired outcomes. The underlying tale is about how Lorraine Howell's actions destroy what's left of a family that seemed to be beyond suffering. Viewers will argue about whether or not Lorraine Howell is genuinely psychic. Accused continues to be the greatest drama on television because it is unbelievably complex, masterfully played, and leaves no room for interpretation. Accused's exceptional production values, which include meticulous attention to casting, make it a deserving contender for the title of finest TV anthology series. It's evident that showrunner Howard Gordon and his group are aware that in order to explore challenging and intricate storytelling territory, they must not only locate exceptional performers capable of bringing those subtleties to life on screen, but also the ideal actors for each part. Casting Felicity Huffman as the defendant in Lorraine's story is certain to provoke considerable discussion considering Huffman's personal legal issues. However, that idea of life mimicking art gives the show a distinct vibe. The main query is whether or not viewers believe Lorraine, which is more difficult to respond to since opinions on the actress portraying her may also differ. Furthermore, Huffman is able to evoke such intense emotion in Lorraine during her sobbing breakdown as she talks about all she has lost, which may not have been achievable for someone without her experiences. In addition to seeing a news article concerning the abduction of Rory Conley, whose parents Frank and Melissa are still yearning for answers a year later, Lorraine asserts that she has psychic visions concerning missing children. Lorraine reports a crime to the police against Ray's Huffman's husband William H. Macy advice, and she is soon invited to move in with the Conley family in the hopes that she would have another vision that will result in Rory's safe return. Lorraine is currently facing fraud charges when the accused promptly discloses how that didn't occur and how much money she stole from the Connollys over the course of two months to pay off a number of bills. However, Huffman portrays the role with an uncomfortable honesty throughout, allowing the viewer to see that when the prosecution implies Lorraine may have even been delusional. The contentious decision was made to centre this episode around a purported psychic. The questions of whether Lorraine truly possesses a gift, if she is a purposeful con artist, or whether she has genuinely created this impression of herself will be hotly debated by audiences. It all comes down to personal opinion. The evidence presented by the accused is circumstantial. Although Lorraine is recognised for having located a girl who went missing in Nevada in 2007, the investigating detective's credibility is severely damaged throughout the witness examination. She has every justification for being in financial need. Beyond that, though, Lorraine's story makes clear how in need of human interaction she is. Another complex character, portrayed by a different well-known actor, is introduced in the season two premiere and provides just what the plot needs. Even by the norms of this programme, Lorraine's story is a considerably bigger episode, so it's easy to understand why Fox decided to air it as the accused season two opener. Although each episode addresses a larger topic, this one really has two narratives with enough drama to last two hours. Two hours. Not Lorraine's innocence or guilt, but rather the emotional breakdown of Frank and Melissa, Rory's parents, as played by Daniel Maslany and Isabella Riser, is the central theme of the episode. Frank and Melissa are used in the episode similarly to Mulder and Scully from The X-Files, with the former being a believer and the latter a skeptic. Even though Huffman does a fantastic job as the show's lead, Melissa's rage is what propels the episode a riser takes on the role of the audience's voice and expresses all that people are thinking when they realise Lorraine isn't who she seems to be.